What is up guys? This is your boy DJ Brandon here and in today's video I got a pretty cool unboxing and review on what I will say in my opinion one of the best under 30 bucks outdoor Bluetooth speaker with I repeat with a built-in little sub that pumps really cool. Uh, this is the iClever IC Dash VT at 03 portable IP65 waterproof outdoor slash shower Bluetooth speaker with 12 hour play time on the full charge. That is pretty cool, guys. Uh, so the box is pretty small, nothing special on the outside. All it has is iClever outdoor wireless speaker, and then the model, as you can see. And on my left hand side, right here, you see an iClever 3 port USB charger with smart technology. Now, I will tell you why I have that there in a few minutes. But first of all, guys, let's go ahead and open up our product and see what's inside. So, I actually only charge the speaker, I have not uh, properly used it. I only powered it up and charged it. And well, I'm actually gonna demonstrate it to you guys. So once you open it up, guys, you do have your user manual, which I will say is gonna be very handy because it actually has questions that you might have and it actually has answers. And it tells you every single specification about every button, uh, how long it takes to charge, the distance, uh, etc. The running time and all that built-in microphone and everything. Um, right here it has uh, special cues that, uh, for example, short press button to end conversation and return to music playback status or long press button to reject the call so you wouldn't know that without the manual that's what i'm saying guys keeping the manual will be handy and then on the bottom you have it like your led indicator what certain colors need and what certain uh flashes need. so i do recommend keeping it and then you also have questions and you have your answers so what would i say a good manual i think i think so and our main product guys right here you have your Bluetooth speaker and it seems that you have 3.5 millimeter jack cable right here pretty cool and under this you have your charging cable now the reason I have that iClever cube on the corner guys is because this speaker does not come with a cube to charge now it's not really a big deal but if you want your speaker to work to the fullest and not have to worry about overcharging uh this iClever charger is actually pretty cool it has smart id technology which means it will power your item to the fullest without any worries of overcharging it and it's just awesome guys blue indicators in the inside it lights up when you plug it up uh this charger is under 25 bucks the link will be in the description below if you're actually interested and so let's go ahead with our main product guys our speaker look at that guys so the speaker is black and orange this is the only color i believe and you know i would say it looks um Pretty nice pretty nice looking speaker I'm not gonna lie about that it is waterproof I will be not I will not be putting it in water I am actually scared um, why ruin a perfect speaker and pour water on it on purpose I know this is a review but uh, I, I can't it's such a nice speaker um, but I mean I seen other people do it um, you know in person and it's actually surprising how the speaker just rejects the water like it's nothing. Oh, it's really good. I trust them that it's waterproof and I seen it. So that's why I'm telling you guys. But I wouldn't want to ruin it and take the chances either way. So on the front, you have your LED indicator, your iClever logo, and your mid, high, and a bit of low speaker. I will say it is around an inch or so, inch and a half, maybe like that. 
and then if you flip it to the back you do have a sub a passive sub and it actually punch really hard guys it, 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 it sounds good it gives the speaker an awesome shaky feeling when you hold in it and then it makes the trap music the bass go pretty hard so it's cool it's, i like it and then on this side you have your uh a little foldable like uh detachable piece of the speaker which will allow it to protect it from water and this is where you plug in your 3.5 and your power cable so pretty cool and it's not that easy to take out as you saw i had to use the cable and that is good so that means the water won't come in and on the bottom of the speaker you do have a tripod uh input like i do right now and i'll be showing you in a second how it would actually look on the tripod once it is in action you have your power button your negative which means lower value play pause and call button your plus which means increase uh, value so pretty cool and yeah guys uh and this is actually detachable all you have to do is just pull on this and it and do the same and it's actually detachable so if you do not want it um i'm still gonna keep it on there uh it doesn't really bother me but yeah guys so i'm gonna go ahead and play a song named panda uh the instrumental version i hope i don't get copyrighted and i'm gonna show you how to pair the speaker so first of all guys what you want to do is go ahead and turn it on and the way to do so is just hold the power button power on pairing power on pairing it will tell you automatically what it is doing so a blue flashing indicator means it's actually looking for a bluetooth device and that it is on so let's go ahead onto my computer and show you how to pair it all right guys so once you're in your bluetooth settings all you want to do is turn on your bluetooth and then your ic-bts03 icon will pop up all you have to do is click on it and pair and it will take around a second or so to actually pair um, and then after that it should say connected connected as it did right now and now we're actually ready to play music so I'm gonna go ahead and set up the speaker properly so you guys could actually hear the full of it in action alright guys so it is on my tripod so like I said I'm gonna go ahead and play a song named Panda by designer the instrumental version Hope I don't get copyrighted and hope you guys can actually hear the quality of this amazing speaker. I recommend using headphones so you guys can actually um, hear the speaker. But trust me guys, um, this is a wonderful speaker and it has amazing highs, mid and lows. So much talking, let's go ahead and actually play the song. Alright, so right now on my computer, it is full volume. All you want to do is hit the plus, which means your uh, volume up until you hear that sound. That means full volume, and now enjoy, guys. I hope my camera can actually pick it up, uh, but I doubt it's actually really loud. Um, so I might be yelling a little bit. So enjoy, guys. So the whole table actually really vibrates, it, it shakes because of the bass, it's really good. I can barely hear myself because it's so loud. So I don't know if you guys can actually see the sub in there, but it is working. Let me see if I can actually, uh, no, I don't think I can, but that sub is working hard. It, it, it sounds amazing, guys. Uh, I, I will say it's the 
the best little Bluetooth speaker out there with both waterproof and a sub. It's just, it's just amazing. So I'm gonna put it on the table, maybe so you guys can hear that it actually moves. Face it down real quick. So I don't know if you guys noticed, but my camera's actually shaking because of the bass. Look at that. So guys, this I would say is. What, the best Bluetooth speaker out there for 30 bucks? Waterproof and everything. Uh, do I recommend it? I really do. Five stars, no doubt about it. Any questions that you guys might have, this is your boy DJ Brandon here. Uh, link to the charger will also be in the description below. Uh, and if you guys are interested in a $100 Amazon gift card giveaway that I'm going to be having, link will also be in the description below. So there you go guys, the best Bluetooth speaker under 30 bucks, really recommend it, no doubt about it, waterproof, bass, loud, that's all you want in a Bluetooth speaker. This your boy DJ Brandon, peace.